If you are a woodworker that likes to make gifts for your significant other that they won't use, this is the project for you. I am starting out with some extra white oak that I had laying around, and this is essentially a woodworking mallet that I'm gonna be using in the kitchen. It's gonna be a meat tenderizer, and white oak is a really good wood for this because it has closed pores. I've also made some out of catalox, or I think it's pronounced catalosh. It's a very, very dense wood, similar to ebony, but much less expensive. As for the face pattern, I'm going with just a cove bit, and this is the one that I found works the best and is, is the easiest to clean. If you use something like a dado bit, it's gonna be really hard to clean in those grooves. For attaching it, I'm using just a typical wedge pattern here. And these ones I kind of freehand cut, but the white oak ones I made a little jig. For the finish though, just a simple food, fit, food safe finish made out of beeswax and mineral oil. And here's how it works in the end. I'd love to know, would you actually use a meat mallet made out of wood in your kitchen?